so what is it for me after I admit this for my dad? You couldn't make it today. Put in 25 years to for lunch. Why didn't you work? I don't know why. I always ask him that. Why, why did you want to do it? <laughs> Obviously, like, he does it because, because he loves Westminster. He loves the people of Westminster. But I want to know about you winning this award. That's what people want to know about the award so much. How comes I've yet to see you give it a mwah? Nah, I give it many times. Even <laughs> oh, hold on, hold on. You did it in secret. Do it now, man. I want to watch. Give it a kiss. Oh, the <laughs> nah, that's because I feel now even uh, in front of my kids and family. Uh, I feel proud. But tell me more about halal rangers because when I heard halal, I thought about a nice bit of chicken. <laughs> no, it's hilal, not halal. Ah, oh, so I'm not hearing correctly. Yeah, this club established it about in 2010, 2011. Established this club to aim on the use. So avoid them getting into trouble, yes. being involved with crime, knife crime, robbing, thiefing. I can say them things. Yes. Once yes. your name was read out and you won the award, what did you do? I got and up. You, yeah, I got up. And then what? And then, and then what? what? What else did you do? Did, oh, no, no, no. You did something else. Did you start uh, to dance? Uh, when I reached uh, for the mayor, yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, I interacted with No, 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 no. Now do, a, do that now? dance again, man. Do that yeah. dance again. Do that dance. Aye! Did your dad give you a hug and a kiss yeah. when he found out that you won the award? Yeah, I went to him. Oh, 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 Mohammed, I love you. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, no, no, no. I went to him to his room. Uh, uh, at that time, it was 1 o'clock a.m. in Sudan. So he was sleeping? He was sleeping, yeah. I wake him up and I told him. Uh, Subscribe, comment, and hit the thumbs. Before I move on to deal with the other issues about your awards, are they heavy? Uh, this one is heavy. This one is heavy? Yeah, yeah. What's it made out of? <laughs> Diamonds? <laughs> yeah, this one is heavy. I have so to so tell me, by, Mohammed. By the way, I'm left-handed. You're left-handed? Yeah, that's why I'm with it. I hold it by my left hand. <laughs> so tell me, mm. you have such a great smile on your face. When I look at this award, it's called the Active Westminster Awards 2018 winner. Then it says outstanding and contributions to sport, leisure and physical activity award from the city of Westminster. So, Mohammed, sir, tell me more about what you did to get this award. Okay, uh, in 2011, uh, exactly in November 2011, I, st I established uh, a football club called Hilal Rangers. And Pardon, say that again? Hilal, Hilal Rangers. Hilal Rangers? Yeah, Hilal, it means uh, we have a team in Sudan back home called uh, Hilal, and <laughs> this means crescent. Ah, that is good, that's in, good, in, I like English, it, yeah. And Rangers is being used by the boys here. Because we, the name it contains a uh, word from Sudan, word from from here, from uh, from Britain. Called uh -huh. Hilal Rangers Youth uh, Football Club. Uh -huh. uh, as well, the the club is being make uh, they been evaluated and by Westminster. Uh, the team has, used to play on the uh, Camden Camden League in Market Road for two seasons. And after that, we have a partnership with uh, Queen's Park Rangers, QPR. Uh, when we have like 16 uh, clubs under Queen's Park Rangers, we are one of them. They usually do like a one-day tournament for all their partners every year, May of each year. Uh, we have their, they've been given their one of their uniform. And uh, you will see the videos as well. 
have uh, we've been taken apart, took apart a uh, few times in their in their one day tournament. But tell me what you've done to win these yeah, beautiful here. awards that have put such a lovely radiant smile in your face. Look at you. Okay. So this tell me is... what was it like on the night you receive this award? What did it feel like? Tell me. Okay. I have two awards. One, I award, uh, I've been awarded for me in December, 8th of December 2018. That's the one I'm holding now. So... I was, unfortunately, I was in Sudan in holiday. So it? you was in Sudan yeah, on the front line, agitating and scaring the Janjaweed. <laughs> no, that ginger is uh, that time the revolution haven't started yet. Oh, oh started, that's true, that's true. Yeah, it started in 19th. I came back here on uh, 13th of December. I was visiting Sudan to see my uh, to see to see my dad. He wasn't was unwell that time. Uh, just very quick uh, trip to Sudan. Um, uh, and when I've been awarded, uh, uh, well, so I, I can't tell because I've been waiting for this for five years because I've been nominated about five times and... Yeah, but you weren't good enough before, was you? Might be. <laughs> <laughs> but, but like I say, describe, when did you find out you was going to win? Uh, in, the, in the same night, because what happened, they nominated three out of 13, and they, and they said these three, they're not going to release the names, who's the winner, till the night. And I have to wait. Yeah, like being shortlisted for three of them. So you was in Sudan, waiting for the news. For years, exactly. Who rung you to tell you what had happened? My wife. Even and what did she say? And she said to me, congratulations, and she said, you are deserve it. Because she, did, she, she's in, uh, she, was, she wasn't there, she didn't, she didn't go. My son went and picked it up for me and phoned my wife because he doesn't care about when he picked it up. He just wants to make his way home. He doesn't so so your son, let, let me just get this. I can see you <laughs> laughing. So your son went to the award ceremony mm -hmm. and when you won, he picked up the award on your behalf and we've got a video to show that. So watch this video. It was because of the football club that now we have the youth club, which is at the store centre right across the road from it. So through football, Basically, we've created something bigger, a bigger community. And obviously, that's not even just for the football youth club. We have, we have people from all ages, genders, everything, ethnic background. So, it's, yeah, it's good. It's good to see. It's good to see. Well, I think you are an outstanding a representative and you, you yourself, a very, very impressive young man. Hasim, thank you very much. Make sure that that award get back to Mary for our Give it up, outstanding contribution. Yeah, he picked up the, the, the award and they've been releasing. By the way, it's a big award in that night because there is eight awards. It's the only one who is being handed uh, by the, the mayor. Most of the one is being like uh, seniors. That any. So main one, your award was handed by the mayor? By the mayor. Is the, and the last one being uh, announced at the end of the night. And that day and that night, it's been released the name and uh, my son he did very well to be honest uh, uh, you will see the video about about it it's a wasn't for me i have to admit it's for my dad and he couldn't make it today but um obviously um he would really he would be really happy about this because obviously he's put in 25 years to voluntary work i don't know why i always ask him like, why why do you volunteer like, <laughs> obviously that like, he does it because because he loves westminster he loves the people of westminster Obviously, um, I'm not, we're not residents of Westminster ourselves, but um, obviously he, um, he has a football club down there, down in um, Warwick, one of the more advantaged sides of Westminster, I, I mean disadvantaged sides, I'm sorry, but um, yeah, so, and then, yeah, he just sort of fell in love with the borough, and just, yeah, he's just well like fucking down there, so, yeah, thank you, thank you for this award, thank you, like, the Westminster as well, and like, the council and everything, thank you. Thank you. Uh, so that I was, was in tearing, December. I was tearing, and I went yeah, yeah. to my dad in his room. Yeah, so that was him, in December, yeah? yeah I'm just summarising for people. You yeah. got the award in December, your son picked it up. Mm -hmm. At the time you was in Sudan because your dad was, was ill. And when you got the award, did you bring some ray of light to your dad when you told him? 
Yeah, I went to his room and I just like, hung him uh, because I told him yeah. to, to pray for me because that, today will be uh, announced the name of the winner. So the, that prayer worked. It worked for me. I, it worked for me. The power of prayer. A prayer for your dad because you he's still your his he's still your his his baby. <laughs> so so come on then. Did your dad give you a hug and a kiss? Yeah. When he found yeah. out that you won the award. Yeah, I went. Oh, to oh, oh, Mohammed, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. I went to his room. Uh, uh, at that time, it was one o'clock a.m. in Sudan. So he was uh, sleeping. <laughs> Sleeping, yeah. I wake him up and I told him, oh. and and he liked it, and so so happy. And uh, in the day after, in the morning, I show him the video from his grandson uh, uh, talking uh, at the stage, yeah, next to the Maya. And I have to run that video about six, seven times all day, and I have to translate it to him because having big all the net, yeah, all yeah, the yeah, way, yeah, 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 it was good. So that was in December. So yeah. tell me about the award you received only a few weeks ago. Yeah, that one in Westminster Award in the Capitol House here next to the, to the Parliament. And that one, it, uh, they do it every year as well, not just for youth and sport activities. This is for the community. And that award as well is the main award. It's called it Heroes of the Communities. So are you now a hero? One of them, because in that might they've been award three, not one. One is the main, and two like uh, second and third. So I, let, 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 I, I get that, you know, people can watch the video, mm -hmm. but I gotta keep my viewers entertained. So yeah. when you found out you had won the award, you got up. Yeah. What did you do when you got up? By the way. The one in the video, this is my second got up because I got up first when I heard they talking about <laughs> my introduction. So you rewind, so you did it again. And Jackie Rosberg, uh, she was you know, meeting me, said to me, Mama, sit down, not yet, you haven't been announced your name. And I sat back and I wait for my name to be announced fully. So when your name was announced fully, yeah. Adam, Adam, put, put the awards down, put the awards here in a moment, they're going to be safe. Because I want you to reenact what you did. No, no, put it down, put it down, put it down. It's safe. I want you to reenact once your name was read out and you won the award. What did you do? I got and up. You, yeah, I got up. And then what? And then, <laughs> and then what? what? What else did you do? Did, oh, no, no, no. You did something else. Did you start uh, to dance? Uh, when I reached uh, for the mayor. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I interact with. No, 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 no. Now do, you, a, do, that dance, do that dance again, man. Do that dance again. Do that dance. Ay! So, oh my word. So, Mohammed, not only are you the chair, not only do you do all the work for the community, you can dance as well. Yeah, I like dancing. By the way, I used to go to the uh, uh, Lombardo dancing as well. Oh, all right then. So you got that award from the mayor, and. Hold it up, hold it up and okay. show me. Okay. Show me. Aye. How are you feeling knowing that you won such a prestigious award? Uh, it's for me and for all other Sudanese community leaders, other leaders. Uh, it is a motivation, by the way. And, and it gives you like, um, what you call, at the end of a long trip of 25 years working voluntary and course, being awarded something like that. In that recognition. Is in recognition from the mayor. I really appreciate it for this British uh, society. They appreciate what you're doing for them and for your community. High appreciation. you have been nominated and being uh, uh, somebody, people voted for you and they haven't seen you or know about you. And they just read about you, appreciate what you're doing. Simple thing like that, it gives a motivation. This is like a word for, for life, by the way. I'm so proud of you. Seriously, yes, I'm so proud of you. Now I can go back, if, if I step down to the community, this is like, I like it. Uh, I can't compare it with any kind of money, by the way, for me, especially. I've got one last question okay. to ask you. Hold up the award, hold up oh, the award. Okay. 
You love the award so much. How comes I've yet to see you give it a mwah? Nah, I give it many times. Even <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, oh, you did it in secret. Do it now, man. I want to watch. Of you. Give it a kiss. Yeah. Oh, I'm proud of you. Nah, nah. Because I feel now even uh, in front of my kids and family. Uh, I feel proud and it motivates them. What I have been doing for the last 10 or 15 years, now it come with the world. Whatever you do for your community, for the people, it's not going to be thrown away. Uh, good afternoon, my name is Ibino. So tell me about your role within the community centre. Yeah, we have actually, uh, if we talk about the community in general, we have different active activities. One of these activities, we have football clubs. Uh -huh. uh, we call it the uh, Hilar Rangers. We have different group of age. In this, about, about uh, roughly about 70, 75, 80, uh, from the youth and from the youngers, uh, different ages. But tell me more about Halal Rangers, because when I heard Halal, I thought about a nice bit of chicken. <laughs> no, it's Hilal, not Halal. Ah, oh, so I'm not hearing correctly. Yeah, yeah, it's Hilal Rangers. That's the name of our uh, uh, club. And uh, this club we established it about in 2010, 2011. We established this club to aim on the use, okay, for to make them uh, busy and uh, to, yeah, to avoid them, to take them away from the street. So avoid them getting into trouble, yes. being involved with crime, knife crime, robbing, thiefing. I can say them things. Yes, yes. That's, Is it that's successful? What, yeah, that's, that's, that, that's, that's, uh, that's the idea about the, the club, to have to, we're trying to get these people out of the street. And engage with engage the club. But yeah. tell me, how successful has the club been in arranging activities and events? Uh, the, the club is really is doing very good so far. We have the football. We have another uh, youth club as well. That's after the football. We have a club for them to come and discuss about the Sudan, about different topics. And uh, even we help them with uh, mass and uh, English as to provide them with good education as well. Uh, so where do you want to see the club in 10 years time? Actually, in 10 years time, we hope that, you know, that, that uh, the, the youth, we train them, we need them to take the lead and uh, and make the clubs to be like known around UK. And we hope to see this as, uh, in the near future, to see a good player uh, in, uh, in a known clubs like... Arsenal. So you want to see a well-known player emerge from within your club yes. to be taken up and bought by one of the Premier League or international clubs. Yeah, yes or no? Yes. Subscribe, comment, and hit the thumbs.